A setback uh, for the Tamil Nadu Chief Minister. The Egmore Court uh, has uh, dismissed a petition by Jayalalitha for non-appearance uh, in the case related to non-filing of IT returns. The court has uh, ordered Jaya and uh, close friend Sasi Kala to appear in person for the next hearing. Uh, Sandhya is on the phone line with more details. Uh, Sandhya, we understand there are two dates that have been marked up by the court uh, where Jayalalitha will need to be present. Yes, absolutely. Uh, the latest uh, order which has come from the Egmore Court uh, relates to a case where uh, uh, regarding the non-filing of IT returns by Jailalita and Shashikala in the early 90s. Now, the court has uh, categorically dismissed the petition by Jailalita asking for uh, relief so that she does not have to appear in court during the hearing. The court has uh, uh, definitely gone ahead and said that uh, she has to appear at the next hearing, which is on the 10th of April. And uh, also, he, uh, the additional chief metropolitan magistrate at the court has also said that this is non appear entertained. So basically, this means that this is a bit of a blow for Jalalita. She's going to have to appear in person for the hearing, which is uh, for the next hearing, which is scheduled for the 10th of April. Remember earlier today, a Bangalore court, which is trying right. to disproportionate assets case too, has also uh, asked for her to appear in person on the 5th of April. Right, so Sandhya. Facing a bit of, so uh, clearly trouble. a bit of a setback uh, coming in uh, for the Tamil Nadu Chief Minister. Uh, the court has dismissed her petition. Uh, she was, of course, uh, seeking uh, exemption from personal appearance.